began with a huge battle of wits between young talents Nordivek Abdusatorov and Gukash. In the first game, Abdusatorov had a great position, but Gukash resourcefully defended and escaped with a draw. The second game also ended peacefully after some big adventures. This meant that the match went to Armageddon. And in the Armageddon, Gukash was in his element. Yeah, Nordebeck shaking his head. Gukash just cruising through this competition. Abdusatorov resigns. Basically, the first two games I was pretty much busted. I somehow managed to survive. He overall played very fast, Zermagadin. So, yeah, I, I just couldn't catch up with his speed, I think. Our second encounter saw the living legend Vladimir Kremnik face Parham Masoglu, a man who was born in the year 2000 when Kremnik won his first world championship title. It was the veteran giving a masterclass in the first game, outplaying Masoglu with the black pieces, which meant that in the second game, Masoglu had to risk it all. Playing the Sicilian defense, he managed to complicate things, but in the end, Kremnik wrapped up his second victory. Should be decisive. Queen B8, beautiful move, covering all the squares, and Parha loses on time. I think it was a close game, but it was not close results because I couldn't control my nerve. Well, my resourceful opponent had found some ways to create me some problems, so it was a bit tricky at some point, but I think I managed to keep control. 